No matter how differentiated your offers, competitors catch up and put pressure on margins. Your best defense is to create a conveyor belt of innovative offers. The key is to understand the innovation lifecycle and what sub-optimizes results. Here are my top three tips. Every business has what Jeff Moore calls core and context. Think of core as differentiated offers that win customers and context as everything else. What's core today will ultimately become context. When you think about the processes that support core and context, anything that generates revenue in the present is critical. Everything else is optional. The innovation life cycle starts in the bottom left corner. You commit to an idea and begin the process of invention. Entrepreneurs and engineers think outside the box to invent core. They tackle the toughest problems and come up with the eloquent solutions. In many organizations, the same team traditionally manages the offer through the entire life cycle. Tip number one, break with tradition. Inventors typically over-engineer things and continue to tinker with the offer once deployed. Yet when you deploy, the offer becomes mission critical. You want program managers that can package and deploy at scale. This is where you'll make the most money. When competitors catch up, the offer transitions to context and you're at risk of losing money. Tip number two, transition once more. During this phase, you'll want a team of process optimizers, people that manage and extract resources to improve efficiency and reduce cost. Sooner or later, they will hit the law of diminishing returns. Tip number three, consider end of life. Here, you'll want to transition yet again, this time to a team that can dispassionately decide how best to offload the offer. Each phase requires different skills. As each team hands over their work, they move counterclockwise to pick up the next offer. Jeff calls this resource recycling, and it's the secret behind creating a conveyor belt of innovation. To learn more, read Chapter 7 of Radical Action for Radical Times, or get in touch to explore how I might help. This has been two minutes on how to manage a conveyor belt of innovation.